Hi everyone, it's Holly. Welcome back to my channel. Um, <laughs> I am always fiddling around with my camera, so I am so sorry that if you are on YouTube, you are going to see my camera go through a real transition, I feel, because the, of the way I upload the Junji Ito reactions. You on YouTube kind of do get to see my up-to-date thing, but I think I am finally done messing around with my camera. I have been messing around with the settings and everything, but like as long as I have been around on this planet, I swear, it feels like it's taken so long for me to get my camera to look like this. Because when you spend like 700 pounds on a camera and you have like a 400 pound lens, you kind of want to get the most out of it. And I think I'm finally at the point where I'm getting the most out of it. Like, so today I'm going to be reacting to episode three of the Junji E collection i just want to say a huge thank you for the response on the previous video if you haven't already seen it i highly recommend you go and watch um i knew that the video would not be like super popular but it did feel like the people that did watch it enjoyed it and a lot of people have said that you know they started off a little bit funny but then they sort of found their footing with it so i am hoping that these episodes only grow in strength I am not going to be reacting to every single one. Um, I, I'll probably do them for a couple more weeks and then I think I'll kind of, you know, have a look at like the top rated episodes and then just react to those instead. Because right now I'm just going in order. But also, if you are watching this on YouTube, I just want you to know that I put my full more or less 95% reaction over on Patreon. So if you did want to watch my full reaction, then over there um and the videos are a lot longer so today like i said we are reacting to episode three of the junji ito collection and this one is titled a boy at the crossroads and slug girl slug girl sounds like i don't know sounds kind of silly but i i don't know i'm sure it'll be horrifying because everything has been horrifying so far I already don't like the music though. Can I just say that? I already don't like the music. Right. Uh. Oh, is he a fortune teller? Right. Is this the fortune teller? The boy at the crossroads? Aww. Aww. The animation is so, like, it's really flat, but I don't mean that in a bad way. Like, I mean that in a kind of good way. You know? Oh, so she's like talking to her friends about it. Oh, God. I want. Is this like an actual thing in Japan? Is it like a myth kind of thing? Mm. I notice a lot of stuff like this seems to take inspiration from... Oh! Oh! Oh no! That's the girl that asked for her fortune! That's wild. Yeah, I was saying that I wonder, like, I notice a lot of things are based on, like, folklore and things like that. So I, I never know whether they're based on anything or if they're just kind of... I'm not sure about this. Oh my god, what? Does she want him to kill? She's gonna ask this kid to kill the family. Oh my 
Oh god. He's a kid. How weird. <laughs> that is slightly creepy. Very creepy. She got cut up as well. No way. あの人を殺したのは僕だ。僕のせいであの人とお腹のない。わい。どうしたの？元気がないのね。緑ちゃん。I Oh, so the story was that she killed herself when actually he was the one that murdered her? God, I feel like the... But then, that doesn't explain... Oh god. I fear that she's gonna be like, I'm gonna ask the, the crossroad person. <laughs> God, he's going through like a real crisis. Don't do it. Don't go. This is like actually super creepy. I don't like this. She's about to get wrecked. No. Oh my god, she's gonna die for a friend as well. Okay. That's not the worst thing that he could have said. Oh, and she didn't die. Is it because it's him? <laughs> I can't tell. At least she's been honest. It takes a lot to say stuff like that. Oh, she didn't have to go that far. Oh. Oh no! Wait, really? Oh my god! What? What has happened to her? It's like it's like the crossroad person has like aged her. Oh my god. She looks awful. He's like, I'm just a high school boy, I don't want this. I don't want this at all. <laughs> oh my god, she's going to be Oh my god, she just like turned into steam, like steam came out of her. What? 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 What?
Doesn't seem great so far. Oh god, I don't like this whole thing. I'm never leaving my house again. Oh my god. Hey. Midori-chan. So he started to fulfill that role. Oh my god. It's like he's slowly morphing into that thing. Oh, there he is. Oh my god, what? Oh! <laughs> what is she pointing to? I don't like it. What is she pointing to? Ah! Is she gonna think that's him? No, there's no way. Get out of the way! Get out of the way! What are you doing? Well, I guess people feel like compelled. Ugh. Oh, he's gone. So was it him all along? I don't know if I follow. Was it him the whole time? The first episode of this show was like, was just not good. Like, I just didn't think it was that good. But like, this had an actual story and it had like a beginning, middle and an end. And it was just kind of creepy. Um, I liked that. Let's move on to Slug Girl. Oh no, what? What? I mean, they are a pest, aren't they? They are considered to be a pest. Oh, I feel kind of bad for them. What is she doing? Oh my god! <laughs> no. She doesn't- she's not puking them up, is she? Pull it out? <laughs> I have no idea what to say. I'm like so shocked. Like, is she gonna die? What? Where did she go? Oh, oh, it's just a head. Oh my god. Oh, it's left her. Oh my god. <laughs> I need to go to bed. Oh my god. Oh my god. That is so grim. Oh god. Ugh, the way that it just had her head as a shell. That's so. That is really messed up. I've never like seen that concept before. Oh god. What the hell? 
<laughs> what the hell was this whole episode? Jesus. I'm not gonna lie, that slug one, like, that was such, like, punchy storytelling. Um, like, that was, that was really funny. Like, not funny in, like, a, like, oh my gosh, it's comedy, but, like, funny in, like, an off way, like, in a, oh, I don't like this kind of way. I don't know what I was expecting, but, like, I, th I didn't know, like, if slug girl, I thought, I thought that it would be a case of, like, Maybe she had pet slugs or something and like she killed people with them. I don't know. I don't really know what to expect, but yeah. So this episode is called Shiver and Marionette Mansion. That kind of scares me a bit because marionette imagery just can be kind of... But we're, we're just going to go with it. We'll... I mean... The last episode was creepy and every single episode it feels like it's getting creepier and like more abstract so I don't know. But yeah, episode four, let's do it. Old man? Is he blind? Oh! Why? Oh, is he a psychiatrist? So is this like an inpatient place? Or are these just like residential houses? <laughs> oh no. Oh, I did not like, I don't like, I'm not like, I haven't got that tri tripophobia thing, but like, oh, just that dis- that did something to my brain. Oh God! Oh, uh, I don't like. Oh, I don't like this at all. <laughs> I do not like this one at all so far. Oh, oh God! She come out like a demon or something. Oh god, this is so creepy. Oh god, this is so creepy. Whoa, his grandpa kept a diary. No, what is it gonna say? Oh? <gasps> A bug? Oh, a jade carving. It's to do with that jade then? Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh god, oh the bugs! Oh, I do not like bugs. For me, this is the worst one so far. So how did the girl get a hold of it? Right, so I'm assuming she must have picked it up or something. It, this for me is like the worst one so far. Like I'm, I'm not okay. Uh. He moves so weird. I think it is. Uh. I don't like bugs. I hate the idea of like a bug entering my body. Uh. Um. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, is his friend? Oh my god. Wanted to like sell it or something? Oh 
Right, okay, I was kind of right then, I think. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh god! Did the old guy take it back? Oh, <gasps> she cured. Oh, oh my god! Then it's called Shiver. That couldn't be more appropriate. Oh, so is this um? Is this the second one? Oh god. Ugh. Oh, so he lives in that thing. I am so sorry, but like you could not pay me to. <laughs> I don't like this. I don't like the doll thing. Please, good lord. Oh, they're like a traveling like puppet theater. Okay, that makes more sense as to why they have dolls. I guess. Oh, Puppeteering is like such a skill, and I feel like it's a dying breed as well of people that can do it. What? Do it. No way! Oh, no way! Oh, it's the, it's the young girl! Yeah, yeah, yeah! And he was like, sorry, I have to go. That's nice. Yeah, she's the one that went over like literally two minutes ago to see the dolls. <gasps> the brother that ran away! No way! What? A house is supposed to look like that? There's like only a few windows. I don't like where this is. Oh god! Oh, okay. Okay. What? Why is... Like, I'm so confused. Is John pierre like, first or something? Oh, I just hate it. Like, it's just weird. It's just so weird. That child is asleep and is being used like a puppet. <gasps> Bit weird. Bit weird. Weird. Oh, it's like a Why? No, <laughs> I don't like it. この家もそのために建てたんだ。なぜそんなことを？That is very odd. Very odd behavior. すごそうに見えるか？私は指以外は完全に力を抜いている。それなのに私は自分の思い通りに動いているんだよ。How weird though, because like, ugh. Oh no. Now she's got them on her. Ah ha 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 ha! Oh, don't like it. 
近私と会ってくれないのねどうして夏美ちゃんはどこかへ出かけて Oh my god ついてははぐらかすしかなかった How would you explain it to someone? なかった No 夏美はすっかりここの生活に馴染んだ Oh so now she just lives with them? 私は一流のバレリーナなんだからなんだいそれは。<laughs> so weird. Just the music is, is really making this like. Just, I don't know. Oh god. Oh, I like it. Ew! Oh my god, are they getting lifted up? It is! It is him! Oh no! Oh my god, what is happening? Oh my god! Oh my god, this stinky little doll. Is she actually dead though? Or is she okay? Whoa. Oh my god, what? Oh. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Again, this episode was so good. It's so weird to me that episode one was not good because like episodes like two, three, and four have been really good. Oh my gosh. The, oh gosh. For me so far, this has been like the scariest episode because the thing with the holes really bugs me. And I'm not usually someone that gets super like scared from things with holes, but that was really scary and just really creepy and I didn't like the descriptions that it was like they breathe through the holes and then the puppets thing I mean that was never ever going to go very well um to be honest like I it was always going to be that the puppets came alive or something like that but I did not expect the imagery of a normal family being pulled along with strings like, I feel like I know what's going to happen and then it's just something so obscure that I, I'm i left in, like, disbelief. So, everyone, thank you so much for watching my reaction to episode 3 and 4 of the Junji Ito collection. I think my reactions say it all, if I'm totally honest. I'm getting more and more impressed with the episodes and I'm sad that I'm not going to be reacting to all of them, but um, I'm so far becoming very impressed with the franchise and uh yeah and i will see you in the next video goodbye